Greetings once again and welcome back to MTG Cards and Review. My name is Chris. Thanks for coming by. Once more, we're going to go ahead and dive right into the next 10 of the uh, Forgotten Realms art cards. And basically keep moving right along. We've got our Null as our number 11 card. And of course we have the Null over here. Kind of a Basically, they're, yeah, they're scored as a humanoid because they do, they are kind of humanish, or at least they walk upright, but they're prop, they're, you know, smelly, they like to rampage, bite, uh, they do have a, they do actually know how to use spears and some may know how to use a, uh, a longbow as well. And, you know, so they're basically, again, they're more of like a, a basically pack animal that can walk, walk upright. So, and not. And then, of course, we come to our flump. Flump? Small aberration. Telepathic shroud, tendril, tendrils, stench spray. Yeah, okay, so it's more like a basically a water -y, although I guess it, either way, it's kind of like a combination of a it's a skunk or an octopus, depending on your take, but it's a flump. There is your flump. Flump, flump. And then we have our Etten. The Etten. Ettens are basically essentially two headed beasts, though. A left head and a right head and basically uh, they th when they're working together they're quite dangerous if you can get one and the other to start arguing with each other you can take advantage of that by uh, and either extract yourself from their uh, attention though and leave them to arguing with themselves or take a, or if you are skilled enough to be able to basically take care of them, they are of the giant brand. I know a little bit about, uh, so I know. A, I shouldn't say I know a little. I know quite a fair about some of these creatures, though, because I've read a number of the. Uh, Mm -hmm. Adventures in Forgotten Realms books over the years, though. We got our Flame Skull here. It's basically, it is, of course, a skull that has flame. It's basically Ghost Rider's head. Um, rejuvenation, spellcasting, fire ray, tiny undead. Well, wouldn't make sense, it's just a flaming head. Undead. Um, can't say I've actually recall uh, reading or encountering something like that. Uh, then we've got our owl bear. They may look cute, but they're not. They're basically a bear, more of a bear than anything, but they've got an owl's head. Oh, uh, that is, you know, again, something to... And then we've got our Butelet, uh, blue, blue, blue tit, blue tet. And uh, this is basically an armored bite, deadly leap, though, large monstrosity, likes to burrow. Basically, 
I give it as a uh, basically like a kind of like a combination of an armadillo for the shell but then uh, basically a, a creature that actually likes to burrow though you know like a mole and um, it has big claws not your ordinary garden pest either <clears throat> well then we got our derider this brings us to number 17 in case anyone's keeping track there's our derider so basically it's a large monstrosity derider is basically a drow that has basically been made into a spider for the body, legs. They are ones who have fallen out of favor of Loth, Loth, of the uh, basically the spider queen. Alright, so we got our ghoul here. Now, ghouls, ghouls, basically just a ghoulish ghoul. Not really much to say about them. I mean, they're in many stories. And our Tarask. Now, the Tarask. Tarask is more like a, basically an ancient... Gargantuan monstrosity, titan style. This is basically kind of like a. I guess I'd say it's a, akin to a dragon, but a cross of a dinosaur in the fact that basically that it's not really a dragon. I mean, think of it as basically taking, you know, obviously you can see the town here, and this is the Tarrasque. Looks like you got. A few uh, people trying to stop the thing, or creatures. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, now this is kind of a this is more of along the size of basically a companion if you can get one. A blink dog. Of course, bite, teleport. me it's a blank dog so all right well guys that's gonna wrap up that segment i appreciate you hanging out we'll move on to the next 10 and see you then have a great day bye for now